Back to the gingery milling machine. In this video I have more of the machine complete. Here I have a setup for milling the compound swivel. I'm using these two um, angle plates and two uh, one, two, three blocks. Uh, here I'm using a three-eighths shaft uh, little milling cutter in my spindle. There's a detail of the underside, unfinished of the um, compound swivel. And I'll take a video of uh, when I've finished it. Now let me get the light over here so you can see the detail here. See this milling cutter is going to mill this bottom uh, surface of this compound swivel smooth. And I'm going to try to take some shots of the uh, milling operation as I do it. I've added a, co a uh, coolant table to my milling machine with a pump that pumps uh, coolant which brings up the milling machine to a whole new level. Carries the uh, aluminum chips away and they go into a filter under the table here. But anyway, uh, I just thought I would show this and I'm going to try to show some of the milling operations and whatnot. Now I'd like to show a little bit about the uh, tail stock that I just got completed. Here's the stock tail stock. It came out nice. I actually was able to uh, mill all the uh, flat surfaces on the milling machine itself. So I haven't really used it yet, but I just thought I would show that. Uh, I don't know if you can see the detail on this thing or not, but that's the stock gingery tail stock. And this is the compound swivel base. Well, actually, this is the universal base. I milled a nice little uh, round slot in it with the gingery milling machine and a little uh, rotary table. Anyway, that came out nice. Just thought I would show a few of these things. And I guess that's it for this video. Uh, more to come later.